Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We're taking a look at Newmore's biggest Class A gas motorhome. This is also the ones that our friends Izzy and MJ from Endless RVing, that's the same model that they own. This is a 2023 Newmore Bay Star model 3626, a gas motorhome with four slide outs. We are gonna be taking a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, and then we're gonna give you three things we love about this motorhome and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Again, welcome back to another video again today i am super excited to be taking a look at this awesome newmar bay star 3626 it's so awesome to see newmars and get our hands on them so i'm glad we're reviewing this one before i begin let's say hi to andrea andrea hi everybody it's last video in michigan it's last video in michigan and what the heck's going on it warmed up yeah i don't need a jacket yes yeah, i'm excited to see newmars you know we don't get to look at them a lot so it's always a treat yes it is and you know while we're here they have an awesome selection of michigan but you know we got to review the best of the best that's right andrea let's begin model is 3626 newmar bay star the actual tip tip length is 36 feet 11 inches andrea this is the newmar bay star it is newmar's top of the line class a gas motorhome it's fantastic i love the headlight designs you got the uh fog lights there nice big windshield andrea this is a fantastic motorhome is this powered by the 7.3 liter v8 it is the godzilla engine side cameras on both sides of the motorhome nice mirrors over there and then look at these tires andrea they're the michelins i love those 255-80 r 22.5 with shiny alcoa rims coming on down here you're gonna see that this is a beautiful full body paint job Full body paint is standard on all new Mars. Very nice power awning with LED lights. And you can see there's two slide outs on this side, two slide outs on the other side. Check out the storage. Nice. There's your inverter. Slam latch storage. All the way through on the Wow. Zion. What do you think of that? Good storage. And then coming on down, we do have a TV on the outside here. And then a little bit more storage there and there. Very nicely in latch doors. Coming on down, you can see that it does have an Onan 5500 generator. A little bit more storage here, and a little bit more storage there. You know why, Andrea? Because you can never have enough. Never, 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 these never, never, these never. last two are kind of more pass through, which is nice. Very nice. Coming around the back, Andrea, we do have a nice fiberglass rear cap. 5,000 pound hitch. This motorhome can tow 5,000 pounds. Very nice rear cap, frameless windows, a backup camera there, and then Andrea, there's a ladder to get up on the roof. It is a one-piece fiberglass roof. I'm not gonna climb it right now. It's still a little moist up there, but uh, there's two AC units and everything. Finishing up, Miss Andrea. We have 50 amp power cord right here, tons of storage. Hmm. Right, more storage. Other side. Yes, here's your fuel fill up. Storage for a stinky slinky. Very nice wet bay. Love that. Great setup there. Black tank flush. Water filtration system. Potable water fill. Potable. Potable. Oh, look. Yes. An instant tankless truma hump water heater. Yes, ma'am. And then coming on down. Okay. Wow. All right. Other side. Other side battery bank oh, napa look. napa know-how wow yeah i bet you love when you get to say that yeah and we don't have any paid advertisements from napa nothing from napa nothing yet and then andre right there's the propane tank and right here bing jen please show all the specifications about this awesome motorhome and andrea as great as this motorhome is on the outside four slide outs on the inside wow. and it's beautiful let's go take a look Here we go. Matt, don't forget the cargo. Okay, wow. Okay, so I'm gonna do a 360. 
I love this. I have to share this again. I always miss it. But 2,455 pounds. That's pretty good. Okay, so look at this, you guys. Opposing slides. It is very tight to get through here. Um, I've got to turn to the side to walk through. It opens up a lot right here. You can definitely open the fridge. Okay, and then walking through. Let's see the bathroom. I can get to that. And you can use the bag with the slide in. I love that. Yes, four huge slides, Andrea. And it's gonna take a minute to get all of these slide outs out. So let's give a big shout out to the sponsor of this episode. Matt's RV Reviews is proudly sponsored by RV Life, tools that make camping simple. Everybody knows when it comes to camping, it can be a little stressful, but not with RV Life. So first, discover, research campgrounds and other locations of interest with detailed information, but for RVers. Plan your trip accordingly with the popular Trip Planner. That software is amazing. It's gonna tell you the best routes and you can go with your RV safe GPS. Not only are you typing in your specifications so it knows not to take you under any low bridges, but you can actually use that offline. So so if you're at a place with no Wi-Fi, you'll still have your GPS and you can share it with their RV community, guys. RV Life is more than just an app. It's an awesome program that all RVers should have. What we're doing is a free seven-day trial for Matt's RV Reviews customers and 25% off on top of that. So all you do is go to their website, rvlife.com, sign up for the free seven-day trial by clicking our link down below or typing in Matt's RV Reviews. Don't download the app because you, then you won't get the free seven days. So do it on the website, register Matt's RV Reviews, then download the app. We appreciate RV Life for sponsoring this video and sponsoring Matt's RV Reviews. Let's continue the video. Andrea, is this not a huge It article? is. You haven't even shown everybody the bedroom with the slide outs open. I cannot wait to share it with everybody. Andrea, we're starting right up front here in the cockpit area. So right here, Andre, 7.3 liter V8. I love it. This is one of the best cockpit areas. I got my auto leveling controls right here. Cup holders here, and then there's where you store a cell phone while you're in transit. Again, the 7.3 liter V8 is very nice. Right over here, we have our cameras, our radio screen, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and everything. Andrea, how do you feel right there? I think I'm missing something. <laughs> yeah, you're missing a table. We I'm saw that last table. time. Yeah, but other, other than it's that, very, how you feel? It's okay. It's not the most comfortable, but um, both these seats do swivel, yep. which is great. And there is some storage above. Yes, ma'am. Let's check it out. Good amounts of storage right there. We also have a little bit of storage right there. Very nice. We do have a bunk over the cab that drops down. Holds 500 pounds. Yes, ma'am. It's very nice. It does and have then, a ladder that goes there. Yes, and then when this... um you can pull this out as well. You know what I'm saying? Tell me why that looks like a happy face right there. It does! Right, that's wow. a cup holder and everything. Very, very nice. And then coming on over here, Andrea, right over here is our control panel. You got your, some of your slide outs, battery disconnect, Euro law, uh, inverter switch and everything. Very nice. Andrea, we forgot to mention this last time. How do you like this? I like it. I mean, I mentioned it when I came in, so ah. sometimes, you know, I don't catch things like that, but this right. is very like, hello, I'm here, so you can't really miss it. Hey, how you doing? Yeah. Exactly. Over here, Andrea, we have a very nice sofa. Very thick, very plush. This does come out to make a bed, which is nice. I love that. Right here, we have a televator. So when it's up, then it's up, and then when it's down, you just put it down, and you have that awesome window. That sits directly across from the TV, other TV. And this is a full pullout, right? Yes. Okay. And then we have storage above. Would you look at that? Wow. Nice sound bar nice there. Sound bar. More storage there. And then more storage there. And Andrea, when you open and close the doors, you can tell oh, you can the quality it. of Newmar. You can definitely hear Check it. Check out this trim here. We also have some lit up trim right there. That's lit. And then here, little bit more storage right there can you see that yes yes Thank you. and then there's another one on that side as well and then over here miss andrea oh yeah oh yeah cabs are here this is such a nice theater seat i got cup holders here i am looking directly across at the television so nice we got storage right there for your remotes and everything 
This is a phenomenal. Cute wall lights, yeah. comps light up there, whatever yes. it is, lights, comps. And then we've got storage above. So, so Three nice. of them. Very nice. And then coming on down here, Andrea, we do have a dinette. This dinette, of course, drops down to make a bed. Really nice. We have a huge window over here. And then if you come on in, another window there. Let's take a look at these valances. Check out these valances. Andrea's shaking her head. What, which way is she shaking? Tonight! Womp, 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 womp. Guys, I don't know what it is. You Sorry, I just don't know. <laughs> You're denying it. I'm just denying it. I just, it's, it's just not, I just don't like them. Now, last Newmar Bay Star, you denied the living room, but you approved the bedroom. Let's see if that happens again this time. Here's what I will say, Andrea. We do have daytime shades there and privacy shades right there. So that is very, very nice. Solid surface countertop here. Um, really nice dinette, very comfortable. It does have storage underneath too. It does? Yes. Got a drawer here, nice. and it's a wow. big drawer. I remember on the other one. Wow. There you go. That's storage. Yes, that's, ma'am. That's what we're talking about. Not only that, you got a little bit more storage here. I don't know if this would have counted as pantry space or whatever. That's very nice. And then. Oh wow. Yeah. No, that definitely would have been pantry space. Uh, you know what, Andrea? I let's just restart that. Andrea, show us the pantry space in I the don't kitchen. I think that's the pantry, but you can, you know, you can do whatever you want with it. Yes. Put whatever in there. Amazing. Adjustable shelves, which is great. Andrea is so nice. We had to see it twice. Show us this kitchen. Okay, so right here we have storage above. Wow. I do like the solid surface countertop. Okay. It's very pretty. Um, got a double sink extension there is a window in here little window a little window and let's see what we got going on over here we've got a place for sponges nice and then oh hey that's 156 dollar trash that, can thanks Newmar. that's awesome and then above oh no that's just for show okay so we got the whirlpool convection microwave yes ma'am I missed the drawers. I just noticed that. I like the backsplash though. Yeah, it's great. It's very nice. We've got a three burner propane cooktop. Yes, ma'am. And then I'm gonna go over here. We got a drawer there. Yep. We've got the same size here. And then over here we've got more drawers. Okay. Wow. Hold on. I don't know if that one's the same. Oh, it is. No, it's a little bit bigger. Very nice. All right. We got a Whirlpool uh, residential refrigerator, I believe, or it's a compressor. Yeah, residential style, yep. With an ice maker in there. Storage above. Wow. Now, Matt, I think this is Whoa, the Whoa, yeah. Look, look at that. Oh my goodness, look at Hold, this. Oh, I'm loving that. What? Very so, nice. I love these drawers. They lock in, you push them in, but this is really cool here. Yes. Adjustable shelves too, I like that. Yes, that's amazing. That's Should an amazing. keep going? Keep going, you know All why? Right. Because I stole your pantry over here. Oh, okay. So you can steal this. What oh, is this? This is prepped for a stackable washer and dryer. So nice. And if you don't want to use it for that, you have adjustable shelves. So you yes, just have more closet space. Yes, ma'am. I'm loving that. Andrea, do you know what time it is? It's now time for, for the, the MSRP. MSRP. Burr, 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 burr. Okay. MSRP on this motorhome here, Miss Andrea, is $276,000. $626, Andrea. That is MSRP. Now, Newmar, we're not allowed to advertise sale prices, but Jen, please talk to Cosmo. If we can show a sale price, please show the sale price right there for everybody to see on television. And Andrea, regardless if we're allowed to show a sale price or not, we do have a sale price, and I know we can get everybody the absolute best price on this Newmar Bay Star or any Newmar. All you guys got to do is go to generalrv.com slash Cash. We've linked it down in the YouTube description below. You can get there from mattsrvreviews.com or you can call 844-969-4033. Please reach out to us any way you can because our team is here to help everybody get the absolute best price in America. In America. Yes, ma'am. You ready? We're going to check out this bag. There's your control panel there that controls everything. And then let's see. What do we got going on in here? Oh, right. nice. It doesn't, it's got a decent step. It's not real big. 
This is a great wow, size shower. Wow, that you is a I'm great saying? size shower. You know, really, really nice. I like how it's a little angled and everything. This is absolutely phenomenal. And look at all the wardrobe space in here. You, yeah, I mean, Here's what I will say, good. it's kind of dark in it the RV, very dark. but it's very light and bright in here. I like it. I love it. the vanity lights, uh, nice medicine cabinet. Oh, where's liquefied? We couldn't bring it with us. Womp womp, dang it, TSA. Guys, bing, that's liquefied, our brand of black tank chemical, Andrea. If somebody wants to buy it, where should they go? They should go to Amazon or primepoopmusician.com. Yes, ma'am. Look at this sink, interesting, right? Right, I like it. It's kind of like a, the silver egg. <laughs> It is. And then underneath we've got storage. Oh, that's a good place for your mm, toilet paper. Sure I is. like that. And then you've got a drawer here and then here, which, yeah, I don't know about that. I yep. guess they did a good job there. Okay. Oh, look. Ah, that's a good place for a toilet paper paper holder. Well, there's one in there too. Is that what that's meant to be? Hmm. I don't know. Porcelain. It's small. Yeah. It's tight but I'm not touching, which makes this, this is a prime poop position. Bing! Very nice. Wow. Yes, ma'am. Oh, look, there's a mirror right here. I didn't even notice that. Look. I didn't even know. Yeah, I know. Attention to detail, Matt. Mirror, mirror on the wall. <laughs> All right, it does have a little towel rack right there too. Ah, very nice. All right, so going into the master bedroom, we have a pocket door. Opposing slide outs. Yes, in the look at the walk well. around room in Fantastic. here. Fantastic. I love this rear window. Huge wardrobe nice space. Nice wardrobe. Wow. Samsung TV in the bedroom. Look at the valances in the bedroom there. Andrea, yes. what's your opinion? Approve! Bing! Just again, Andrea <laughs> approves the bedroom and denies the living room. Nice little storage there. So we have what? Five drawers? Wow. Very nice. One, two, three, four, five. Wow. Nice king size bed. Yes. Wow. King size bed. Power and USB on both sides. You do have two windows on both sides. How do you like those headboards there? It's okay. Okay. And then huge wardrobes, or not wardrobe. Storage. Storage above as well. Got little nightstands with the USB electrical outlet, and then underneath you have some more storage. Yes. And then same on the other side. Yes. And is there storage under the bed, I wonder? Of course there is. Bumping, There's the ladder bumping. for the bunk. Yes. Very nice. Andre, it's a nice motor home at a phenomenal price. Hopefully we could share the sale price. And regardless of if we could share the sale price, that's it. That's the review. Now, before everybody leaves, it's time we give you three things we love about this motorhome and three things we just don't like about it. Andrea, what do we do first? Matt, let's do three things we like about it first. Why are you switching it up on yeah. me? Yeah. I'm gonna go first. Okay. This bedroom, double opposing slides in the bedroom of a gasoline motorhome. That's what I'm talking about. And you know what? I'm gonna combo that. Four slide outs on this motorhome. Fan freaking tastic. Matt. That's number one. I am going to say, I like the opposing seating in here. Yes. It's it's nice. You have the, the front seats up there as well. So you have a great area to entertain people and it's very comfortable. Yes, ma'am. Some of the best furniture yes. in the RV industry for sure. That's number two. And then Andre, number three, I'm going to talk about the chassis, the tires, the storage, the cargo carry capacity. This is such a big, awesome motorhome. The fact that it's gas, and they're still able to accomplish all of this is fan freaking tastic. I'm loving it. That's three things we love about this motorhome. Andrea, now it's time for three things we dislike about it. And I have two on the outside, hopefully. I have one. On the inside? I do. Well, let's kick it over to the outside and then we'll wrap it up with you. Andrea, dislike number one for me, the carpet inside the storage compartments. So many times I'm throwing wet stuff in there or you're packing up in the morning and you have that morning dew and then you throw it in there and then it's just gonna get in the carpet. I don't like that. And then it's gonna smell. Exactly, that's dislike number one. Andrea, what is dislike number two? Andrea, dislike number two. I cannot believe they did not give you a 50 amp power cord reel on a top of the line luxury motorhome like this. Not only that, the fact that they did have the space in here. Right. That's a huge dislike. That's dislike number two. Andrea, what's dislike number three? Dislike number three. Okay guys, 
I'm not a real big fan of this right here. Whoa! Um, I think that there's a lot of storage in here, and it, it's it's already like adequate. So I kind of wish maybe they put a fireplace in there, or maybe a picture or something. But I just yeah, that's just too much for me. Andrea, I I would have to disagree. I think the more the merrier when it comes to storage. But here's what I will say. I would love to hear, guys, do yes, you agree you with Andrea or do you disagree with Andrea? I am, I'm not going to lie, Andrea. I think I'm going to win this one. I think people are going to like the more storage, but I never know. We never know. The only way we know is if you guys comment down below. That's right. Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are interested in this new more or any new more, please go to generalrv.com slash matchcash. We've linked it down in the YouTube description below. You can get there by going to mattsrvreviews.com or you can call 844-969-4033. Please reach out to us any way you can. Our team is here and they are dedicated to helping people get the absolute best price in America. Andrea, what say you? Hey everybody, thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. Yes. Newmar does read the comments. They do watch the video, so please leave your feedback. I hope you guys are safe and well. Thanks for watching. Thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching. And Andrea, we'll see you next time.